going on back. I guess I haven't actually been down this little side before. Or if I have, I don't remember it. There's a little dead end. Hi, dogs. This goes on over. A lot of crumbly stuff over that way. I, I won't go that way. But this continues on over. Wow. There's a big yellow line. Yeah, look at that. It's a real big yellow line. Oh, yeah, so that's it. Now we're back over to the to the mystery capsule of stuff back around. So we made our way all the way around again. What does that say? Team? Team Bopper, maybe? You haven't noticed that before. Okay, I'm going to head back over that way. So again, we're looking up in the ceiling at this just giant tree. I mean, that's a full-on tree. You see, there's another littler one over that way, but this is a big tree. I mean, it's like four feet across. More. Yeah. Maybe five. It looks like a single one, too. I mean, yeah. it has all the shape to it. And then it's all falling down here so i mean there's 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 some petrified wood there's somebody that studies these things that probably know what kind of tree it is <laughs> like a geologist or something yeah <laughs> that is massive <sighs> just ready to fall on me too yep. it's interesting how it's not as strong where these old trees are yeah that makes sense though it's more like yeah. Oh yeah, look look at the quartz and stuff up in here. Wow. Yeah, look at those crystals. I mean I don't know if you can see the shape, but yeah, they have a real crystalline it's like you can almost look into it. Very cool. Very neat. All right. And this is what I call the grand ballroom. Because it's this big open area. You can see it just goes way off. That's where I'll go, but it's just really big and open all through here, going way back over. That's like a bag of old blasting powder over there. And then again, there's more petrified wood up here. More big logs. I mean, look at the size of this one, long. Okay, so it ends about here. And it's going down and down and down on over that way. So yeah, that's really neat. Continuing on and on and on. And, <laughs> and then we come over and here's more that's fallen down. Yeah, I mean, look, there's other wood. So this is old forest somewhere, a whole bunch of old trees. Just look at all that yellow in there. Those colors are just incredible. We're really 
probably wondering what the yellow is. What sort of oxides make yellow that you would find in a uranium mine? So, still kind of going through the grand ballroom area. And then it narrows down a little bit. Some boreholes. Now, here's a fun one. See this pile of uh, detritus, I don't know what you call it. This pile of loose stuff here, that's because there is a borehole going up and up and up and up and up, way on up. So it's like they did a sample there. I don't know if they went up or they went down, but there is a big, big hole. Oh man, it's a nice piece of exhaust. Might need that to fix the Jeep. Okay, and now this part is the milk ceiling, crystal ceiling that I call it. There's just this fine, fine, fuzzy mineral growth here and it's and it's just it's super delicate and soft see i can just touch it but i don't know if you can really get the perspective on it and just see how fuzzy it is and how it just sticks and grows out of this whole ceiling here just super fragile stuff too i mean like these tiny tiny little like hairs or strands that are in there. It kind of glitters as you move past it. Bunch more yellow. And then there we're looking back on the milk ceiling. Going on back, here's something that's been piled up. And I don't know that I've ever been down there, but it does look like it ends just a little ways down, so it's probably why I haven't done anything. Might go check it out at some point. Oh, here's some other neat colors. So you've got yellow, real strong yellow, and then green, almost like a copper oxidation green and then it continues on over there makes you wonder how much how much copper's in that and stuff like that like the yellow the green that all kind of weathers out leaches out somewhere else and runs through it the water carries it through the sandstone deposits it along the way Ooh, here's some more. This is more like hairs growing out. Just, just really delicate, fine. And it looks like the type of thing you ought to be seeing on a sci-fi show about an alien planet. Wow, yeah, look at that. And then there's totally different growths right over here.
that dog up there. I think this just dead ends down here, not too far, if I recall. Yep, okay, yep, that's an end, but we can go a little ways more that way. Again, look at that smallpox looking ceiling up there. Here's another fuzzy wall. Really fuzzy wall. It's like salt crystals or something forming or yeah. See if I can dim it a little bit, see if that helps see anything. A little bit. Yeah. Absolutely awesome. Just look at that growing out. There's a really good wall of it right down here. It's worth taking a look at that.